software users to interact with visualizations right from their iPad or iPhone. Let's take a look at some of its features. Go to the App Store on your iPad or iPhone and download the Spotfire Analytics app. When you open the app for the first time, there are quite a few hints that will be displayed, like the ones you see on screen here. Tap to dismiss these hints. Let's tap the navigation menu. This menu contains quite a few options. Gallery holds all your favorite dashboards. Libraries contain information about any web player URLs you may add. If you have access to Spotfire Cloud, you can enter the user credentials here. If you host any on-premise web player, you can use Add Library option to enter those details. Once the connection is made, you can browse to the library. Tap on the dashboard name to open the file on iPad. Once the file is opened, you can choose to filter, share, control or annotate the analysis file. Let's tap close to close this one. The next important aspect of the iPad application is the settings. You can find information like version details, end user license, etc. We can use timeout to change the timeout settings. If you see any issues with the iPad application, you may enable logging using the log application activity option. Once the issue is replicated, tap on email support option to send the log file to Spotfire support team. Help option takes you to the iPad specific documentation. Please leave any suggestions or questions in the comments here or visit our community site. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much for watching this video.